Hey guys, it's Josh. I hope you're having a good day and welcome to Nevada. So this is the first episode of my FSD Across America series and we're doing a 10 minute trip to Walmart in Fernley, Nevada. So I haven't pre-tested this or anything. I have no idea what these roads are like. So here we go. We're starting off in this little neighborhood. And yeah, we'll see how it goes. Hopefully nobody comes because the system always drives too far to the left. But it seems like a sleepy old little town here. Not too much going on. And I'm still on 10.4. This is being filmed on um, Saturday. And I forget what day it is. Um, but we should be getting 10.5 tonight. See if we can make it. Should be good. Oh, you guys should have seen it on my first attempt. I went down this, like, into this industrial town and it ended up being like the bumpiest, roughest road. And then the roads were closed because they were private roads. And then Oh, it was funny. I was kind of nervous because it's the middle of nowhere in Nevada, you know. <laughs> Looks like we got a person here, no problem. Old Corvette. And then the left of the stop sign. So I think this will be an unprotected left. Oh, yeah, and a tough one, too. Let's see how we do here, guys. Oh yeah, no traffic, no problem. So I do apologize for the night drive. I'll typically be uh, driving during the day, but I'm kind of eager to get the first video edited and out to you guys. So it's gonna be a night drive here for the first one. Yeah, one thing I've noticed, guys, um, the unprotected left videos, like, do much better. The algorithm likes them better, people like them better, or whatever. Um, so I'll probably be doing a few more of those since they're so popular, so you'll have to excuse me for kind of, uh, you know, uh, playing to the algorithm. But as a small channel, I do need to get views and likes and all that kind of stuff, so I do have to think about that. So you can kind of imagine here you're, we're doing a evening snack run to McDonald's or to uh, Walmart. Um, I didn't choose on the map where to go, I just told it Walmart. Um, in hindsight, I probably should have selected an actual spot. Um, but let's see, let's see how it does. Uh, we got some traffic, but their lights turning. Yep, yeah, was good. The one thing I think Tesla's already really good at is selecting, is like um, allowing the user to select on the map and then navigating to that spot. It's something that Uber and Lyft and those folks have to do. It's a feature, and I think that's something they're already very good at. So for the robo taxi service. Um, I think that part will be already handled really well. So it looks like we have a roundabout up here. And we have to take the third exit, so we'll see if it gets out right. But so far, so good. I had planned to shoot in Reno, but Reno is actually a larger city than I had realized. And when I got there, there was a lot of traffic and stuff. I didn't want to get off the highway and get, get bogged down. 
this little big hotels and casinos and stuff. I didn't realize it was like that. Um, and then I kind of wanted to navigate to the Tesla factory, but I didn't do that either. <laughs> so I guess here we are. I think that roundabout's going to be tough. I wish I had selected um, where to go within the actual Walmart because who knows where it'll be trying to take us. Oh, this roundabout's not going to be too fun. I got traffic ahead, traffic behind. Looks like it's trying to go in the wrong lane there. <laughs> Coastery, but and there's our exit, guys. Wow, very good. Not very comfortable, but perfectly, uh, perfectly safe and predictable. Um, didn't really have any traffic to interact with. Oh, that's okay. And looks like we're gonna take a right up here, so we're gonna want to get in the right lane. is not getting in the right lane yet. It usually gets in quite early. Okay, I did one blink there and then stop. There's actually someone far further back in that lane, so now the car will have to contend with traffic. I'm not sure what the logic was there. Um, I really wish I had changed lanes, but what are you gonna do? got a mind of its own. Let's see if we can get over here shortly. Okay, blinker, very nice. That's great. Traffic behind me and next to me and still did fine. Okay, falling a little close there, but kind of the right lane. And around here, carpet ride over here. I'm going to slow it down one. It's been going through corners a bit fast. I can see the Walmart, guys. This is cool. It's got its blinker on. Stopping really early here for no reason. No one around us. It's really nervous here. I don't know if it thinks it's in the U-turn lane or, or oh boy. Oh god. Come on, baby. That's a curb. <laughs> Very nice. Okay, we got a right only here. Oh, okay. No, we don't. So it's left blinker on, stopping. So it's really slow and awkward through here, but doing fine. Are those charging stations up there? Look like a, maybe Electrify America. Okay, yeah, looks like we're, we're getting close. I'm nervous around this car. Yeah, I think, I think we're, we're there. I don't know what you guys want to consider a success. I'm not sure if the system um, is supposed to drive through parking lots or not. Or not. Do you guys let me know if, if the system is rated for parking lots? I honestly don't know. Uh, but yeah, looks like we've done it, my friends. All right. Cool. That's all I got for you today, guys. I, uh, I hope you enjoyed episode one and look forward to the rest of the episodes coming out shortly. But good way to start. And hope we get 10.5 soon. Cheers, guys. See you next time.